Okay, so we've just taken delivery of a new bandsaw. It's a Charmwood BS250. Uh, I won't go into the saga of how long it took to get here. There was a lot of issues trying to get it here. We were waiting quite a while, but it's here now. So I'll just do a very quick unboxing and then we'll set it up and do some test cuts and stuff like that just to give you a quick run through of the product itself and how easy it is to get going. Just another quick run through of what's in the box. So we've got the saw itself. Uh, these are a cast iron table. Uh, we've got the fence. Uh, there's all the various different screws and stuff and the rubber feet. Uh, the braces uh, for the legs. Uh, we've got the fence bolts. Uh, Allen keys, the push stick hook, spanner, the fence guide with the rulers on it and the legs. That's the entire contents unpacked. Okay, so that's the stand assembled and the rubber feet on. Uh, the next thing we're going to be doing is standing the saw upright and uh, tightening up all the bolts and that. So we're going to get in assistance to get this standing up and then we'll come back to you.
So there she is, finished, all set up and ready to go. Uh, just about to do a quick test cut, just to see how it's going. But everything looks in good working order. I've uh, set all the bearings and the blade tension. Just give you a quick walk around of it. So the tool holder is really good idea, really good. Uh, as well as the light. We've adjusted the, uh, the blade speed as well. And we're just about to plug it in and do a quick test cut. So we're just going to do a quick test cut here. Yeah, give ourselves some light. Hopefully I might make you guys see it better. So you can hear it's actually very quiet compared to the old bandsaw I had. So, here we go. Yeah, it's quite a clean cut. Probably won't be able to focus on it, but it is quite clean and smooth. Uh, the fact that it's so quiet is brilliant. Uh, yeah, so very happy overall. And uh, probably the next time you see this, I have a couple of guitar bodies to start cutting out of Telecaster and uh, Les Paul. So I'll probably bring you back when we start to cut those. Uh, just as a final word, I just want to say thanks to Craig in McQuillan Tools on Cable Street uh, for sorting this out for me. For arranging for it to be delivered and keeping in great contact all during it. Uh, I'm trying to think of a nice thing to say about the delivery company but they kept it for several days and didn't deliver it and they've had it all weekend as well and it's Monday now, it just got here. It should have been here last Wednesday. But uh, that's that, so thanks again to Craig and very happy with it so far. I'm about to get stuck in to do some uh, work now just doing some more test cuts and then we'll be cutting out some guitar bodies so hopefully this machine will serve us well